Last day solo trip, getting ready to haul out. All packed up. Wind is howling. Bluebird day though. About minus 15, wind chill will be about minus 20 or so. I'll be hauling, wearing my gauntlet mitts. So it was a good trip. And I left some wood and my balsam boughs. I never got fishing this trip either. And there's still a few weeks left in the lake trout season. So I think I'll be coming back to go fishing. On the way out here on the trail, there's this beautiful stand of old jack pine and black spruce. Pure, pure, pure jack pine and black spruce. Yeah, there's a couple sticks of poplar in it, but it's a magnificent stand. It's in its prime. It's it's not really falling apart yet. There's a snap off there. Some of the trees are dying. So this stand was all born in fire. Real hot stand replacing fire. And killed everything. There was probably pure pine here and black spruce before. And they seeded in and they probably came in about 20, 30, 40,000 stems per hectare. And uh, it would have been a real competition for light and nutrients and space. And these jack pine are totally shade intolerant. So only a couple thousand make it to maturity so most of the trees that are born in the big fire will never make it and they die out. Fire origin jack pine and black spruce and a few sticks of birch and poplar in here but otherwise pure jack pine and black spruce. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. This stand is just in its prime and it hasn't really started to blow down and fall apart. When it does, it'll turn into a pile of jack straws unless it burns first. And there's a nice cut trail here for access for snowmobilers, for ice fishing, and us winter campers 